Hey Derek. Hey. It's um, Saturday AM check-in time. How are you doing? Fine. How's events doing? Good. How's Gen Con? Great. Nah, it's so good? Uh-huh. You are feeling? Wonderful. Fine. Well, I could tell that Derek was really in a great mood for talking this morning. I'm going to the JW now. My uh, event is there with a bunch of friends. We're going to do an escape room. And I'm rushing there because I'm a little late. And then I'm going to rush back because I'm going to be late because of how my event ends for um, the Twitch stream for Gen Con. And then I'm going to... Oh my god, it's just so many things back to back today. Then I think it's a costume walk, then it's pin trading, then it's a game called, a board game called Endangered, and then immediately after that, it's this my board game time with my viewers. So, yay. You're gonna be in a vlog with my face, maybe. Is it? Okay. Uh, it's a video. I'm gonna ask you how, if you guys had fun. Did you guys have fun? Totally. We really had fun. Yeah. yeah. Was yeah. it difficult? Like, was this your first escape room? Yes. It was. Yes. A lot of you. Yeah. yeah. Most of us. Yeah. It came pretty naturally to you guys. Because yeah. <laughs> yeah. you know, like, I've done a bunch of them, and you guys were just like, okay, well, this is how this works. Here's your answers. <laughs> <laughs> um, would you recommend other people try it? Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. How long did it take? Is it scary? Do people need to be worried about it? Takes no, I have panic issues, and I was fine the whole time. So. Mm -hmm. yeah. it takes about an hour. Totally a lot of fun. And yeah, this one is like four escape rooms in one. Yeah. So it was a really way, good way to sample a few. Uh, all right, go team Godball. <laughs> Thank you. So if you remember yesterday, I said that you know I was doing good emotionally, mentally. Oof, but I can feel it punching me like a truck today. <laughs> I can feel it creeping in to my brain, which is actually kind of nice that I can sense it coming on, that I can sense the sensory overload, the lack of sleep, the overstimulation, I'm an introvert, so just pushing myself so hard to be extroverted all the time, I can I can start feeling it, essentially. Um, so I'm very sluggish and a little slow today. Though, we just did an escape room, and it was awesome. We killed it. We did so good, and uh, we had so much fun with it. Highly recommend Into the Dragon's Lair escape room. I think that's what it was called. It was in the JW Marriott. They're doing it next year. Try to get tickets, but it was really hard to get tickets as it was. And uh, yeah, we just had such an awesome time. I will update you soon. I'm about to go do the Gen Con streaming thing with Peter Atkinson. It's going to be a couple of hours. And at 1.30, I can get on with my the rest of my day. So since I scooted over so quickly from the JW back to the Westin for the live stream thing I'm doing. I have like 10 minutes before that happens, so laying down for a second. I want you all to remember that this is Saturday of Gen Con. There are 60,000 people here. There's 20,000 events. Those events are spread out across over 10 different locations. The Convention Center, Lucas Oil, all the hotels. You're probably not getting enough sleep. You're certainly not drinking enough water. You're um, constantly on your feet and walking around. Your mind is being forced to be very extroverted and constantly engaged and energetic. And there is, even though you may not notice it, but there's a constant assault sensory with, uh, visually there's so many things. Other, uh, you're hearing all of these sounds all over the place all the time. You're touching things, picking things up. Um, you're just n you're just not giving your immune system a chance at all. So I've developed a little headache. I just took some meds, gonna lay down, and remember that I left Gen Con and I left my body, and I'm not treating it particularly well. So. I'm giving it a little break for a few minutes before I have to go do something. 
just remember that, you know, it's okay to get a little, I don't know, like I build up Gen Con so much to be this best thing in the world and it's so important, you know, we plan it almost a year in advance, you know, we have to get our badges and our tickets and our hotels and all of that. So there's so much pressure, like emotional pressure to make Gen Con be perfect and the most fun thing you ever do. And that itself, that idea of perfection is going to fight against you. Nothing is perfect. You will get a headache. You will get overwhelmed. You will get tired and exhausted. And it's not until you kind of accept that that will happen that you will really, really, really enjoy, enjoy Gen Con. Um, I'm having a down moment right now. And that's okay. I know why I'm having it. I'm doing something about it. And in a couple of hours, I will be back to having some energy and normal. This feeling will pass. And it is okay to be sad and depressed at Gen Con. Especially when you're a couple of days in. It's normal. It is fine. It happens. That is part of the experience. You just have to be okay with it. That doesn't make Gen Con any less awesome than it is. I still love it. I just have a down moment sometimes. That's okay. I just wanted to let you know. Okay. I have family with it, like close, so okay. easy trip. Well, you're cheating, but that's okay. Well, <laughs> less money on hotels, yeah. more money on games. Are you staying until tomorrow? Um, actually, after today, I'm beat. I'm probably not coming back tomorrow. I'm beat today. <laughs> I'm falling apart. <laughs> but I expect you to come back tomorrow. Okay. I'll be here. I'll be <laughs> right. here until Monday, until Tuesday. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. What's the best thing you've done while you were here? Um, well, what's been my most useful tip? if you have any useful uh, tip that I gave that you applied to your um, so Thursday morning figure out which games sell out fast yeah and then Friday morning grab the ones that are most important to you yeah <laughs> yeah in the, in the hall or in the like events um, in the hall typically because okay. I found I mean, out which yeah. ones sold out really quickly I barely got Emmerdale Thursday morning even though I could have gotten another time yeah. once you get it it's off your worry list yeah yeah you should make a hit list and hit those first Right. That one. Thank exactly. you so much, Caleb. Absolutely. Thanks. Bye.
get a player from each team to go head to head. It's like a category, maybe like dogs, movies with dogs. So you battle it out until someone's stumped. Then you, you get if you win that advantage, you get to look at six cards. And the six cards, you're trying to pick the three that you can get your teammates to guess by using one word, quoting it, or acting it out. And then you give the three hard ones to the other team. Okay. So um, the goal of the game is to collect movie titles from each genre, and there are eight genres in the game. So that's, and then once that round is over, the next two players go head to head to figure out who wins the, the advantage, and then you go over. Oh, it sounds a little bit like monikers or something like that. Exactly. So it's like monikers in the second half, and yeah, the beginning yeah. half is kind of like family feud. You yeah. go back and forth battling. Yeah. Yes. That's cute. So I said hi for you. Darcy? Yeah. Yep. Hi Darcy. I would love to meet you and shake your hand, but I hope you enjoy my videos. And is she here? She is. She's actually probably somewhere right over there, okay. sort of watching us from the shadows. Oh, that's funny. I hope you're enjoying the convention and uh, maybe I'll see you around. <laughs> okay, bye. She's not going to cosplay, no cosplay here though. This year. Uh, nice to meet you. You nice only got in you. yesterday. Yes. You're here today and yes. tomorrow. Yes. What are you either excited for? Or what have you done that you, that's been oh very exciting? Oh my gosh! I met Sandy Peterson. Uh, Who's Kutubu, Sandy? Uh, he makes Kutubu Wars. Oh, I played that yes, game. I should know. It's so good. Okay. Um, and let's see. I got to hang out with James from Skybound Games, and I backed Trial by Trolley from. Uh, Cyanide and Happiness for Kickstarter. Oh, cool. Uh, so I get to go play that later, so I'm cool. really excited about that. That's exciting. You're, you're doing Gen Con right. You're pushing a lot of things yeah. into it. Well, thank you for saying hi, and thank I you. hope you have a wonderful Gen Con. It's good to see you. Thank you, you too. <laughs> I love Gen Con. I get to come out of the hat box. Oh, cool. Well, what's your favorite part of Gen Con? I think meeting all these lovely people. Very cool. Ten games. I love games. Aren't you tired yet? It's been three days. It has been a long week. <laughs> you just get to sit there. You just got to sit sit there? Oh, well doing this is still hard work. I bet. These, these are my friends. This is Matt oh. and Stuart. You've hello, seen man. You've seen me before. And uh, hello, Fred from the zone. Hello. Uh, thank you so much for saying hi to us. Oh, well, you're very welcome. Hello, this is Amanda. 
Amanda. Hey. Hi. This is not only just her first very ever first Gen Con. Right. What is this? This is my very first con really? ever. Ever. Yes. Ever. So she was like, hello, Deep End. Yep. I'll have one of those. Go big or go home. And, you know. uh, and you said that my videos helped you prepare. Yes, so specifically the one about, you know, Gen Con, what to expect. It really helped me give an overview of what a con is like in general, um, how to pack, what to yes. expect as far as long lines, how to access like how to optimize your your con experience yeah. um, both for like fun times and, and getting involved and diving into new yes. things but also for um, making time for self-care and mm -hmm. also food and eating and, and sleep <laughs> I was like go away Derek well cool I'm glad that you had a good time Thank and you. you have made it to day three well your day two yes my um, day two but you've survived. I You've did. Huzzah. done the most difficult part. Yes. Thank you so much for saying hi to me. Of course. Right. Thanks, guys. Bye. on the face. That's good. How did you do? Not great. I What's got it battle? in the face. What's your battle <laughs> report? Four. I was in fourth on the first one and fifth in the second. First, mm -hmm. second, and third. I suicide bombed uh, myself a couple of times. Third on the first one yeah. and I think last on the second one. Yeah, third on yeah. the, well, let me double check my, maybe I'm lying. Nope, first and then the first game and Second, second game. And I was second, yeah, I'm doing first second. Did you have fun? I did, yes. That's fun. What, what is it like? Uh, it's like a very poorly built car. Uh, lots of flashing lights, lots of things going boom. If you're big, it takes a long time to stop and turn around or move backwards, which means the smaller people can run right into you and blow you up. Do you think anybody can try it and they shouldn't be nervous? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. What's about if you're, fun. What's if you're really bad and embarrassed? I came in last. <laughs> Would you do it again? Yeah. Okay. It's fun regardless how you do it. It's just fun driving big giant max around. Big giant robots blowing right. stuff up. All right. Michael Bay would be proud. Shoot people in the kneecaps. That was down. good. That was good. <laughs> All right. Thank you, team. Okay. Oh my god, Swata! <laughs> What's your plan? He's going to dump the dump! What piece of gear? Which I think is the Castleus. Doesn't one. matter. Now we can talk. No, she's going to win the game. <laughs> talk nothing. She's going to win. Uh, she wins. Dang. Dang, Stacy! Oh my god, Stacy! Stacy! Oh, yeah. Stacy! <laughs> Right, See, this is, this is much better played than the last time we Damn did. Geek. Yeah, that was fun. Yeah. So Jasmine just walked me back to the the West End. It is like 2 a.m. We were playing a bunch of board games just now. It was fun. And we did battle tech pods and stuff. And 
you know, it's Saturday, so everybody goes home tomorrow, and I'm gonna miss them so much. These are my friends. <laughs> this year's Gen Con was so good. It was really great. I met so many fun people. I had so much fun with my friends. <laughs> Tried out Gen Con streaming. <sighs> Ran some events. Tried a bunch of new stuff. <sighs> it was just so good. And now it's a whole <laughs>